Hi guys, happy Saturday. We're back for another uh, live kettlebell workout. Just like the previous weeks, we're gonna do a 12 minute EMOM. We're gonna get started with a mobility warm up, and then we'll go into the workout. So thank you guys for joining us today. Hopefully the weather holds up so we don't have to rush and get inside somewhere, but it looks like the sun finally came out. So we're gonna start first with a mobility warm up. So we're gonna start with our inch for a walk out, so down towards your toes, out to a high plank. We're gonna do a plank press up, and back to your toes. I'm here, I'm here, I'm here. <laughs> we're gonna repeat, keep going with that. We're gonna keep repeating that. Breathe through it, keep the core tight. Three, two, one, and time. Now we're gonna go into Spider-Man stretches. So back into that high plank position, alternating left and right. Begin. Breathe through the stretch. We have three, two, one, and rest. Now we're gonna go down all fours. Bring your knees right underneath your hips, hands underneath the shoulders for cat cow. So arch up and drop down and breathe out. Warming up all those spinal muscles. to our backs and we're going to warm up the abs and core with some hollow rocks arms by the ears teeter back and forth and begin breathe out five four three two Time. All right, we're gonna repeat that one more time and then we'll get started. So again, starting with our walkouts into plank press up. Begin, down to your toes, high plank, plank press up, and back down. Back up to your toes. Breathe through it. Keep moving, we're almost there. Five, four, three, two, one. Stay in that high plank position and right into Spider-Man's. Begin. Good, breathe. those hips. Five, four, three, two, one, and time. Nice job. Let's drop down. Knees underneath the hips, hands underneath the shoulders. And cat cow begin. Curl up. And breathe it out. Up. All the way through, get the spine nice 
nice and warmed up. Three, two, one, and flip it over. Hollow rocks and begin. some water if you need it and then we're gonna get going into our kettlebell imam you just need one kettlebell you will adjust the reps of each of these movements depending on what weight you're using so if it's a little bit lighter you may be able to get through a little bit more if your weights a little bit heavier you may need to cut back on the reps that we have so our first minute we're gonna do a push-up with a shoulder tap on each side, and that counts as one rep. So Kevin's gonna demo push up, and gonna go tap, tap, and that's one rep. And you have 10 of these within that first minute. Whatever seconds of left remaining of that minute, you'll rest until our second minute. Our second minute, we're gonna go into a tall kneeling clean and press, or curl and press if your weight's a little bit heavier. We have two on one, keep the core engaged in the high kneeling position, make sure you don't dip your hips back, curling up and overhead with that movement. Again, we wanna go 15 reps here, but if you have a heavier weight and you need to lower the reps, do so lighter, increase the reps, then do so. So it's gonna be 10 reps of the push-ups, 15 reps of the tall kneeling uh, clean and press. Minute three, we're gonna go into suitcase with the rotation. Suitcase deadlifts with the rotation. So now you're gonna stand up towards your feet, pick up the kettlebell, rotate to the other side, and then repeat. Make sure you fully stand up before you grab that kettlebell again. So don't grab it in a bent over position. You wanna make sure you're saving your lower backs, keep the core engaged. We have 20 reps total. So pick up, rotate is one. Pick up, rotate is two. For 20 within that minute. And then our last one's gonna be a one-arm SAQ frog jump. So you're just gonna take your hand, tap the opposite leg, and then jump in, jump out, and repeat with the other side. And that's 25 total, not per side. And then you'll rest whatever is remaining in that minute. So that are all the movements that we're gonna be doing. We're gonna cycle through three different rounds of each one of these. All right, guys, so we're gonna start with minute one. I'm gonna get a clock going. Yes, I do. One second, let me get my clock. And we're gonna start first with our push-ups. Tap, tap. All right, so let's get, in, yeah, let's get in position. And so you can count that. All right, we're going in three, two, one. All right, 10 push up, shoulder tap, shoulder tap is one. 10 reps. Make sure you keep your hands underneath those shoulders. Strong push up from the ground. Breathe out, core tight. that press nice and strong strong stance shoulder tap shoulder tap and then rest we have 20 seconds remaining and then we're gonna go into our tall kneeling clean and press for 15 reps or adjust accordingly depending on your kettlebell weight going in five four three two one begin 15 reps core tight
Guys, try to keep your hips in full extension mode the entire time, aka keep your ass tight. So there's no bend at the waist. I'm pushing. Again, adjust your rep range depending on your weight. We have five seconds remaining in the minute. Then we're gonna go stand up and begin. Two keys, deadlift with the rotation, 20 reps. Adjust your reps if you're using a heavier kettlebell. Alright guys, we got three seconds, two, one, and single arm SAQ frog jumps, begin, 25, total. About 20 seconds remaining. We're gonna go back to those push-ups with the shoulder taps. 10 seconds. Approaching our second cycle of movement. Three, two, one, begin. 10 reps. Breathe it out. <laughs> 10 reps and take your rest. And we have tall kneeling, clean and press in 15 seconds. These suckers are tough ones. 15 reps, but adjust accordingly. Going in five, four, three, two, one, begin. Breathe it out. Come on, you got it. We have 15 seconds remaining. Take your rest, finish up your reps. We're gonna go into our suitcase deadlifts with rotation. 20 reps and begin. We're on our next minute.
keep breathing. Got 15 seconds remaining. 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Begin. I say cute frog jumps. 25. Come on, keep pushing. Breathe through it. Twenty seconds left. And then we're gonna cycle back down for our last round of exercises. We got 10 seconds. Push up, tap, tap, 10 reps. Three, two, one. Let's do this. Last cycle of movement. Come on, guys. Here you go, 10 total reps. We got 30 seconds remaining. Then we're gonna go into tall kneeling, clean and press. 20 seconds, core engaged, butt cheek squeezed. All right, going in 10 seconds. 15 reps, or whatever you had to adjust to. And begin. Come on, guys, keep going. The last round here. Guys, keep pushing. We only have one more movement after this. Got 30 seconds left. Finish your reps. More than enough time.
Grab some water once you're done. Come on, finish them up. You got 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one, and done. Great job, guys, today for another round of our 12 minute EMOM job, live guys. Saturday class. Remember, now you want to do your one to three mile run, bike, or row, or ski erg, whatever you have available to you. And if you really want to challenge yourself after your run, come back and do another 12 minute cycle. So let us know which one you did. Let us know how you felt. And it should be getting easier each week. Guys, you're building on this. Getting better and better. Thank you guys for joining us today. Angie, how are you? We will yeah. see you in the gym yes, next see, week. Yes, I hope you actually joined in, not watched like a movie. Now they all know. <laughs> Thank you guys. USA Disinfection uh, Services, thank you again for disinfecting our our facility. We're excited to get back to business. This place smells brand new, like a new car, but in a new facility. <laughs> All right, guys, USA, have a great weekend. USA Make sure you certified. stay in touch with our, our <laughs> nice job, Angie. Stay in touch with our Instagram at Hiffinus Warehouse so that you can see up-to-date notices of when we're reopening. And guys, they do house calls. USA Disinfection Services are great. Even finish what I'm saying. Uh, there we go. They're back. They do homes. <laughs>